afternoon everyone. I hope you are all having a wonderful time. So I just arrived to Hua Hin and this is the first time I am visiting this beautiful place in Thailand. In today's vlog, I'm gonna make a review about Hua Hin and see what's my first impression about this beautiful place. So now I've just checked into my hotel from here. I'm going to Hua Hin Beach. We're gonna check around a little bit, see what's the real situation. After that, we are going to visit the night market, the train station and everything you can do in Hua Hin. So it will be my first time checking all these things and hopefully it will be an interesting vlog. So let's see what will be my first impression about this beautiful place in Thailand. Let's walk and talk. So as I said, I just arrived to Hua Hin. It took around two and a half hours from Bangkok. It was a smooth trip, a road trip from Bangkok to Hua Hin. Along the way, we visited lots of beautiful places. I'm gonna make a vlog about it later. But today's vlog is my first impression about this beautiful place in Thailand. And let's see what's the real situation these days in Hua Hin. First of all, we are going to take the car and go to the main beach because I'm staying now in Cha Am Beach. So here we are, as you see, it's 20 minutes drive from the hotel I'm staying till the main beach of Wahin. Let me start showing you around. It's so calm. It's around 5 p.m. And let us see what's going on in Wahin. Lots of motorbikes and bikes if you want to ride at the beginning of the main entrance of the shore this is Hilton so I'm sure lots of you guys have stayed in Hua Hin before but this is the first time I'm visiting this place so as a first impression it's so calm and it's kind of unique entrance not like Patong or Phuket I thought it's a night market here but they said to me this is the entrance to the to the shore as you can see from the pictures there are lots of places if you want to shop wear a mask before entering the beach well let me put my mask guys sorry As you see or hear some entertainments at the entrance of Wahim Beach. Let's check the main shore. Well, this is unique in Huahin. There are some ponies or horses, I don't know. You can ride and take some pictures maybe here we are this is Wahin main shore as I heard it's not a big shore like Patong or Pattaya or Jomtin and I can see as I said there are lots of dogs here there are some people here so it's not totally empty although the entrance seems like that and yes it's a rocky shore so it's not too much fun to swim here in Pattaya and Phuket you don't have rocks and the shore is much more clean that's what can I see from here so that's Hilton at the main shore of Wahin and there are some horses here you can ride them and take some pictures maybe later thank you let's walk coconut trees so as i was saying lots of you guys 
of course have been here I want to know about your opinion what do you think about Wahin is it a good place to visit till now if you like a calm place relaxing this is the place it's not like Phuket or Pattaya and I'm gonna make a vlog about the road trip there are lots of good places to visit along the way from Bangkok to Hua Hin, like temples restaurants but this vlog is my first impression about Hua Hin. we are going to visit also the night market so maybe we do the vlog of the night market another vlog if this vlog will not fit the night market we will see that so people are enjoying walking around I don't know if they are swimming too actually I don't like to swim here but I don't see anyone swimming here anyway well that was a general idea about the main shore in Hua Hin now we are going out to walk at the main street because as I see on the Google map the train station which is also famous lots of people tell me go check the train station it's only one kilometer from here so I think we can walk let's go and along the way to check what's the situation on the main streets not at the shore I hope there will be some action as you can see from the pictures it's so calm there are some people around but it's not busy and I have asked a couple of people they told me that uh, usually wine is not like this it's busy but of course because of the restrictions and the rules till now Wahin is suffering so this is Wahin train station yes it was one kilometer away from the main shores so if you are here and you want to check the station then it's only one kilometer away we're gonna cross to the opposite side and check this station these are the directions at the entrance you have the directions so let's check what is it about this beautiful train station so from here you can get the tickets and this is the main station wow it seems so old yes it's really nice as if you are in 19th century so this is Wahin train station and I don't know if there will be any train passing by now it's around 15 minutes to 6 so here we are after waiting 30 minutes the terrain is going to pass by so I hope you will enjoy these beautiful pictures from this Huahin station so these vendors are going to wait the train and hello they are going to try to sell some food to the people that are already in the train it's really beautiful to catch all these pictures from Hua Hin train station although the shore was boring the city is empty but the station was really interesting especially with this action the vendors are trying to sell the food to the people that are already inside the train and of course the passengers are trying to catch the train to go to their destination
So I hope you enjoyed everything we showed you through this vlog. Now we are going to the night market to see what's the situation there. It's around 7 now. I hope it will be more interesting. So thank you for watching. Stay tuned and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.